Good morning, Box. We are on our way to the Biosphere 2, uh, which is really, really cool. I've lived in Tucson for 10 years. Something like that. Something like that. Uh, nine years. I've lived in Tucson for nine years and never been to the Biosphere, which is a really cool tourist attraction that we have here. So since we're going to be moving soon, we're like, let's do all the things that we should have done a long time ago. It's called Biosphere 2, by the way. Not Biosphere 1, Biosphere 2. The reason is, is because the planet Earth is Biosphere 1. What is the Biosphere, Ken? The Biosphere is the planet Earth. It's the highest level of organization the from a ecological... Or, oh, you mean the, the, the Biosphere 2 <laughs> is... Um, it was originally built as a test run facility for future potential habitats and like space exploration and to do kind of close off systems and study how you kind of have like small ecosystems and like contained environments and it didn't work out very well and then the company that was, it was like a it, complete failed experiment it's my more, or less, more or less and then the company that and then the company and then the company that uh <laughs> Can you be quiet for just a minute and then it'll be your turn? <laughs> the company that was funding it uh, ran out of money. They went under. It got bought by the U of A and that's who owns it now. And it is very, very hot. So for those of you that want to know, today's high is 115 degrees. It is almost one o'clock which means we are probably sitting around 112 113 degrees right now in the sun fahrenheit don't fahrenheit. worry oh, if yeah. it was celsius we'd be dead we would be died yes <laughs> we um. would be died <laughs> um although it feels pretty close to dead well no it doesn't i mean i'm in pants and i've got my undershirt and my overshirt and my vest on um and there's two reasons for that one i'm an arizona native so even though it's 113 after you get the initial over the initial like i'm walking into an oven <sighs> You, get, you just gotta get used to it, and I'm fine right now. Um, the other thing is that dressing in layers actually helps you maintain a cooler body temperature for a period of time, though. <laughs> you know where I actually first learned that? Hmm. Bill Nye, the science guy. Is it really? Yep, he's yeah. the one that taught me that you should dress in layers. Yep. Might have been reading Rainbow, but it makes more sense that it would have been Bill Nye. But for example, as this outer vest heats up and I can feel it getting warm, I can take it off, and it will provide some cooling in that regard. Yeah, and Irene and I are probably going to die. Not yeah, really, die. but we're about to enter some air conditioning here really soon because it's very, very hot to wear a baby uh, in 115 degrees. Although, can we talk about what we're wearing right now? It's adorable. Yeah, so I've got these chemistry suck pads that I ordered off of Etsy um, by Silva... Oh, I just forgot the Etsy shop. I'll try to remember to link it down below. But I checked it yesterday and they didn't have these suck pads anymore. Um, but they're chemistry and I bought them because they match Roslyn's twirl skirt. Yep. And she's also wearing a shirt that says Thing One. Yep. Which Aiden and Kendra bought for her. A hair bow that says Thing One, which my friend Elise bought for her. And Irene is in a matching onesie and bow as well. So yeah, her thing says thing too. Yes. And 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 I've got my little father of all things, and Heidi has her mother of all things. It's just father of things, not oh, all things. Father of all things. Yeah, that's a little presumptuous. <laughs> but we're we're father and mother of <laughs> these two things. So. <laughs> Did you hear that? What your sneeze? My sneeze echoed. <laughs> I don't think we've said hi. So good morning, Box. How are you today? Good. I'm glad to hear that. Hope you're doing well. If not, I'm sorry to hear that. But I hope this vlog shows you up because we're at the pasture and it's really exciting. We've got all sorts of cool stuff here, like this. And the water cycle. Wow, that's way more intense than a lot of my students build. And Rosalind's all excited. Let's go, Rosalind. Come on, let's go look, exploring. I'm coming, I'm coming. You're coming. You're coming. Okay. That's pretty cool. Bucks, welcome to Jurassic Park, I mean Biosphere. <laughs> it really does, it kind of feels like Jurassic Park. All right. We're just watching that too. Careful, Rosalind, don't step on the ants. Be nice to the ants. <laughs> what? 
What, you don't have to swarm you and attack you? I don't think they care whether you're nice or not. <laughs> what are you looking for? I want it. <laughs> I want it. Animals. Animals? Oh my goodness. <laughs> One day she's not going to be happy you took that video. <laughs> yep, yep, I know. <laughs> All right. What do you think so far? It's cool. Rosalind's very upset that she's not seeing more animals. Yeah, she is very upset. And she was saying shoo to the ants. We are currently in the desert, which seems a little redundant, but he said he was about to explain. It's why a different this kind of desert. Different. Yeah. And frankly, it's the most comfortable because it's not humid. <laughs> there will and, be more animals. And there's wind here, and it's all artificial, so it feels really nice. Or heat exchanger. <laughs> Hi from the world. Come here, Ross. So this thing is blowing the air pressure out. We have just got a little burst of wind. Yeah, Rob. Okay, let's try and go back inside. Okay, okay. No, 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 no. Come here. Is that weird? Is that funny and weird? That was weird. <laughs> what happened? We lost Irene's hair bow but in we, the wind tunnel. But we had to go get it. We got it back. Yeah, we got it back. You don't like the wind tunnel? <laughs> you don't like the wind tunnel? Well, we got to go through it to leave. Please. Yeah. Show us how brave you are. You got to okay? be brave, okay? That is quite the climb. Whew. I know, we do it real fast to catch up with our group. Rosalind, come here. Come on. I feel like I'm in Doctor Who. Yeah. Come on, we're gonna look for them. Ah. I can't wait, Rosalind, no, 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 that's not ours. Don't touch that. Hurry up, baby. Let's go. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> that's an adventure. Yeah, it reminds me of that episode of Doctor, Who's where, Doctor Who where they're on Mars. Oh, yeah. Doesn't it? Waters of Mars, yeah. Yeah, Waters and Mars, that's the episode. It's hot. So Ken's gonna go cool off the car. Yep. But we have no cell phone service, so. When this reaches zero, the alarm's gonna go off. You need to come out then. <laughs> okay, execute mission. So we decided to go to the aquarium, AKA. The free zoo. AKA. PetSmart. Woo! No, Ross, you wanna buy a fish? It's shark. Those aren't sharks. Those are it's not sharks. Want to touch? You wanna touch? touch? You, we don't touch you can't fish. Touch fish. That kills them. You can't touch the fish, Rosalind. Yeah, I'm sorry. You can pretend. You can touch the tank. That's fine. Good morning, Box. How are you today? Good. I'm glad to hear it. I hope you're doing well. If not, I'm sorry to hear that, but I hope this vlog cheers you up. I'm feeling a little bit hypoglycemic because I did not have much to eat today, but I'm eating some Otter Pops. And they're giant and awesome. I'm on my way to Phoenix right now because I have to drop off uh, my passport, a copy of my passport, but it has to be done in person. And some paperwork. Yeah, I'm going up there and coming straight back. It's gonna be fun, let's go. And I am back. <clears throat> um, almost a week later to deliver more stuff. Um, it's uh, four o'clock right now, they close at five, so I made it here on time. I'm gonna go turn on my paperwork and uh, give them a copy of my passport. Hey, Roslyn. Hey, Wookie. What, what's uh, Tiana doing? Hey, Wookie. Yeah? Wookie. Is she pumping? Pumping. Pumping. Who is she pumping for? Pookie. Pookie. Pookie? Pookie. She was saying, Mama Pookie. Tiana pumping for baby Tiana. You're so cute, Roslyn. Pookie. Roslyn, what did you say? This is just that's what she keeps saying. She put her bracelet on baby sister and she keeps saying, Baby sister's so pretty. Roslyn's pretty too. <laughs> Hi, Irene. You happy? Your 
コチコチコチコチコチコチコチコチコチコチコチコチコチコチコチコチコチコチコRoslyn's very upset because her dinosaur is gone. I'm sorry. She has to go find the dinosaur. Are you hearing her? Yep. Where are you, dinosaur? No, no. Roar! Hi, Buck. Hey, there's some Anna. Hi, Anna. Roslyn, um, I cannot help but notice that you wanted to end the vlog. I haven't done that for a while. So, what do we do? Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thumbs up, uh huh. And what else? Uh. Subscribe. Subscribe. Where do they subscribe? Subscribe. Down below. Down below. And? And check more. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye bye. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. Hug. Hug. All right. Bye bye. Uh. Oh, okay. Awesome. He said bye bye. Bye bye.